How's it going? Today I'll be showing you how to use the filter method on arrays in JavaScript. So filter allows you to remove elements from an array if it does not pass a certain condition that you define. So for example, if we define an array called numbers from uh, 1 to 6 and we want to remove all the odd numbers from this array and keep the even numbers we can do that using filter. We can define a new function called even numbers. This will be equal to numbers.filter. So with filter, you need to pass in a callback function. This function will take one parameter, being the element you're currently on in the array. So we'll write down n for number. Now in the function body, we want to return an expression that will evaluate to true or false. So we want to test if the number is even. To do that, we can just return n mod 2 equals 0. So if a number mod 2 is 0, then it's even. So we're returning the expression n mod 2 equals 0. This will be either true or false. If it's true, then the number will stay in the array. And if it's false, then that number will be removed from the array. So now if we log out even numbers, we should see our result. So we'll refresh Chrome, and we see 2, 4, and 6. We can also uh, swap it around and log out the odd numbers by putting an exclamation mark in front of the expression and wrapping it inside uh, parentheses. And this will basically just not the condition, so swap it around. We can now refresh and we see we get 1, 3, and 5. Now in ES6, you can also shorten this to an arrow function. We can instead write down n and then uh, our condition. So n mod 2 equals 0. And that will produce the same result with the even numbers. So we can refresh and we see 2, 4, and 6. And that is how you use the filter method on arrays in JavaScript. Thank you for watching. See you later.